but more so the spiritual side. So with that, everyone was given a number, and as their number was called, I would call different ones. If your number was 17, you let whatever that prayer was. If the prayer was um, health. health, you led us in that, in that way of health. So at this time, um, like I say, it's many over in the dining hall, but I'm going to start from this way. I'm going to work my way to the other side of Sister Cheryl Hills. This is, um, I believe, I believe is going into the 10th grade, and this is her prayer board, and um, you can talk about what's going on. I do struggle, um, struggle with, you know, focusing on my prayer life. So I made it a school, you know, different people at school need me to make sure you're praying on home and personal things, like health or something. And then I put some reminders on um, one of them saying, I will not let society dictate who I am. It's a reminder the universe will be seen, you know, um, be a light to the world. Don't you know, let evil get to you. Amen. Amen. Next one is um, Kennedy. Price Kennedy is going into what? Forest. Okay, and this is her board. I hope I can talk about you. So this board is about me. Um, when I was little, um, so I thank God for um keeping me when I was little, and um, and this board is about keeping me out of school, and um, so I won't be doing bad stuff at school because God is with me all the time. Amen. Amen. One. school, faith, family, and guidance, and those have the individual prayers that I want inside the cards. And on the bottom, we have these two scriptures, Jeremiah 29, 11, for he knows the plans he has for me, and Proverbs 4, 14, don't let evil, don't walk with the evil doers. And uh, my role, as you see, is always leading to Christ. Either way, I got it. Amen. One. Okay, so, um, Ivy, stand to the side. Kennedy, stand to the side. Mm -hmm. um, if anybody else have their board, you can come stand, come up, and then we're going to just come up that way, okay? All right, you can stand to the side. Next is Sister Johnson. Here, um, as it relates to my board, one thing that I truly believe in is if I'm going to pray for it, I need to believe in what I'm praying for. So this here is a little reminder. Um, the, way, the, the way I have prayer is not the original straight across. And the reason being is, when I go to pray, I'm in the ER. That's my emergency room, my connection to Christ. And this here is, is just a reminder of that. Some of the areas that I would like to start off as it relates to this, um, this journey, getting closer to um, God and keeping my faith, that holiness and whatnot, praying for family and friends, um, health, um, career and business, finances, and I'm still waiting on God to show me what other area that he wants me to focus on during this period. And one thing that we did share and discuss last night was, no matter how we started today, understand it may not be exactly the same two months from now. Because God may lead us to something differently in regards to our prayer life. So we have to be ready to make that change for him. <clears throat> and then down here, I'm expecting something. I'm not just going to be praying just to pray. I'm expecting something. So I expect my answer prayers to end up where they are. And the reason being because he said he loves me. And I truly believe that he loves me. And the flower is to re a reminder of Tanya continuing to bloom, continuing to be that light, continuing to just go forth in him. Because look here, I cannot do it myself. I cannot do it myself. And once again, I thank God for my partner right here as we went, and went through the journey of this um, the prayer board event. I thank God for the leaders of um, Sisters of Unity. And I, I, I yeah. even thank God for Pastor yeah. because being here courageous and courageous. I wasn't even here when God placed that in, the, in your spirit. Mm. But look at God. Mm. Only he can do it. Yes. Only he can do it. And it was amazing how, you know, we know each other. But 